guys welcome back to another video in today's video i'm gonna be showing you a new green basilisk emerald i got here at the scientific name up on the screen but yeah i'm super excited so let's go show her guess she's really uh like in the uvb rays today as you can see she's like right under the uvb <laughs> she was actually basking on sorry for that right there on this branch but she decided to move up there so yeah this is emerald you can see she doesn't have a crest yet on the tip of her head which means most likely since she is about six months old that six months like three three to four actually most likely to them. She is a female. And I like the name Emerald either way, but you can see the patterns on her. Yeah, she's not the smartest. <laughs> you can see the patterns on that beautiful one that you can see. The white and the blacks, the green belly. Yeah, Um. and obviously her tank's the girl tent. You've already seen it, but I'll still do a quick rundown. Here's a little montage. You guys saw from that little montage. She's definitely gonna be home. Like that's her in the tank right there. Um, but you can tell she uses every inch of this already and she's not even full grown yet. So like I've seen her, the first day we got her, she was swimming in this pond like crazy. You guys can see that's the pond down there or pool, whatever. It's like a five gallon tub, I believe. Um, and also the first day we got her, she actually ate out of a bowl, that bowl down there. She ate out of that. Um, which I found really cool because most of my animals don't eat the first day. Oh, she gonna jump? Yeah, most of my animals um, don't really eat the first day when you get them. So this was definitely really cool for her to eat like that. Obviously, she's. I believe I can fly. I believe <sighs> yep, and that's why I have a bunch of images and plants everywhere. There she goes. You can see she's actually pretty. Uh, not too skinny. Not too fat either. You can see that. I reached out to a lot of people. They were like, "Yeah, she's really healthy, so that's good." Um, she's got this big elephant ear in here. Oh, there she is. You can see that like, green belly now. Look at that. Just beautiful animal. See the head bobbing. So I'm gonna just back up because that I means she's a little bit nervous or intimidated of her territory. You guys can see that beautiful green. That nice long tail. And it's long already. But um. Yeah, and I just have this nice branch hanging from this rope up on the pole. And then I got this hanging, some pothless plants. She's actually been in there once. And then we got a hide down there, which she goes in. It's like, it's a pot. She's been in there a few times. Yeah, she's really liking this enclosure. At first I was worried because she wasn't basking like at all the first two days. And then I, all I did was add this branch right here that like goes to the bottom next door pond comes up goes to this rope but she can just climb across the branch and jump off that's what she's been doing here she is you definitely camera shy so far oh look at those eyes though i'm actually far back zoomed in but look at that let me know if you guys like the name emerald i mean i'm still gonna be sticking with it but let me know if you guys like that name by the way, those zip ties look sharp, but I actually, uh, before she was in here, obviously long before I took a lighter and went over them. So you can see, they are not sharp if you can see that there. Oh, it's like that. But yeah, she's got a uh, 5.0, I believe. And right here, where she basks, is exactly 13 inches under it, which is great for her, obviously. Um, and also, I've like I saw you saw her on the rope, she also sometimes comes up here and sits like right under it if she wants it a lot. Um, I've had her for like a week, I want to say. So, kind of pretty used to her behaviors almost. Um, you can see that the elephant ear kind of died off a bit. It's just great to have an animal in this enclosure. Just amazing. Um, this elephant ear is growing like crazy. I've had to cut it down so many times. Um, 
she's just such a cool lizard and I can't wait to see when she gets bigger and when she's eating more. Right now she's on a diet of mealworms, crickets, and a little bit of dubia roaches, but since I have a colony down there that I'm still trying to breed, um, I can't really feed too, too much, but I just bought like a pack of the other day and fed some to her and all the animals. Um, but yeah, she's doing great. Um, I'm gonna eventually get some fish for her pond, like small, uh, maybe daisies, rice fish, or something like that, so she can eat them, but not yet, obviously when she's a bit bigger, but yeah, this is her closure. That is emerald. You already know I had to do a proper outro. Thank you guys for watching another one of my videos. If you guys did enjoy today's video, make sure you like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, uh, join my Discord, first link in the description if you want to chat with me and stuff like that. Join my Instagram if you want to see daily pictures of my animals. And I will see you on the next one. Make sure you do your research. And I'm out. Peace.